Does your dad have any idea who might have done this to him? Yes, he does. Does he think it might be someone in his organization? Most likely. But do you think it might be someone else? Caroline, you don't, in your wildest dreams, think that Ridge would have anything to do with that picture. No, I hadn't even thought of that. Although he is getting his share of pleasure out of all of this. I know how much this hurts you. No, I don't think you do. And I'm certain that Rich doesn't. Honey, he and your father have never gotten along together. I don't even care about that. What is it then? It's his total lack of sensitivity. I am so surprised by it. And disappointed, too. He knows at least how much it hurts me when he laughs at my father. Well, sensitivity has never been one of Rich's calling cards. Thorn, on the other hand. I'm going to let you get back to work. Please tell your father that I came by. I will, Stephanie. Thanks for your visit. Keep the faith. Whoever has done this will pay for it. I'll see you at dinner. Well, darling, I'm here to tell you everything that's been going on with the family this week. Your brother here has created quite a commotion. Don't believe a word of it. Mm. He's managed to get himself engaged to Brooke. And at the same time, he's alienated himself from Caroline. Well, I feel badly for Caroline. It's just that her old man is a joke. Apparently, I'm not the only one who thinks that either. He's very determined to find out who's done this. Well, I'd like to find out who did it, too, and treat him to a steak dinner. You're having too much fun with this, Ridge. It's because I've earned it, Mother. Oh? Why? Because of something that happened two years ago? Things would have been a lot different if he hadn't gotten between Caroline and me. Listen, don't live a life of regrets. You've made a decision. You're engaged to Brooke. There are no regrets. Well, are we here to talk about me or to see my sister? Oh, I wouldn't think of ignoring your sister. Should I get her tray? Thank you. Can we take that dirty glass out of here? What the devil is this? Is that a cigarette butt? Somebody's been smoking in here. Why, I can't even begin to imagine. Well, I want an explanation. Todd, would you come in here, please? Yeah, did you call me, Rich? Yes. Um, could you explain this for us? Do you have any idea where that came from? Todd, this is Angela's room. We'd rather only you or the family came in here. Well, no one, no one's been in here, Rich. Do you have any idea how a cigarette got in here? <sighs> yeah, that's it's mine. I had no idea that you smoked. Well, from time to time, I, uh, I do smoke a cigarette. You, of all people, a doctor? <sighs> Stephanie, I've, I've been under some stress lately, uh, but I assure you, this is not a habit. Well, a habit or not, we'd rather you didn't do it in here. Yes, and I'm upset because I think we all know about the research on passive cigarette smoke. Yes, I'm aware of it. Please accept my apology. I, I promise this won't happen again. Please make sure it doesn't. Thanks, Todd. That's all. Well, I'm just absolutely amazed. I had no idea. I've known him for 25 years. I didn't know he smoked. As a matter of fact, he's been vocal in his opposition to it. It's pretty strange, isn't it? 